what's going on y'all welcome back to the garage and welcome to my entry into the four horsemen's outer space theme build and uh it's kind of super excited about this one uh i like i like i like challenges like this and uh so what you see in front of you is a 19 it says copyright 1978 i don't know when this came out uh, but I had one of these in like silver. It was like one of my favorite cars to play with as a kid. Uh, I want to say it's called the Inner Story. And uh, kind of see there's like a whole lot of stuff going on there. And in the back, uh, there is like an indie looking, you know, go-kart looking thing. Freaking awesome. I found this at like a trade show like a year or two ago. And uh, I just had to have it because I remember having one as a kid. And uh, I just needed it. <laughs> I just needed it, y'all. So then, this year they came out with this Rapid Pulse. Uh, and it sure does remind me a lot of my older car right here. I'm like, man, that thing is thinking cool. Always reminded me of some kind of space shuttle or whatever. Uh, before there was a space shuttle, this car was out. And I just thought it was such a cool car. And then they came out the Rapid Pulse. I said, well, you know what? I'm gonna use this car and not mess up that car. And uh, yeah, so that's what I did. And cheese and crackers, what the heck did you? Wow, okay. And you got wheels on you, son, I see that. So this is what I came out with. And uh, yeah, same car. Yeah, I kinda see the semblances there. Just did a little cosmetic changes to it, a little recolor kind of thing. And uh, yeah. I really like how this turned out. There's no guns. This is literally just a shuttle or a life support pod, you know, a life pod. Uh, just in case, you know, just in case things happen. This has like four big engines on the back, all kinds of things in there to help you. And uh, this, I'll kind of show you on the inside here. Uh, there's like a big red gap there in the inside. And there's like some kind of alien there, some kind of. I don't know, robot driver, I don't know. I don't know, y'all. So I just had fun with it. So I just added things on the inside. There's like some kind of microchip there on the bottom. Uh, yep, yep. All kinds of stuff is going on up in here. Up in here, look at this. I like it. I, I like it a lot. And I think that uh, it was a lot of fun. It was an absolute, a lot of fun. Yeah, we'll just drop that right there. How about that? How about that? But uh, it wasn't much of a build, but it's a great build. And you don't have to have guns to have a spaceship. Uh, shuttlecraft is just fine with me. Emergency life pod is perfectly fine with me. I like it. I'm a, I, I had fun. I had fun. And it is rusty and dirty and kind of kind of beat up. And there's some nasty welds on there, you know, where this thing's been repaired before. And there are wheels. And so, so you can't have wheels on a space vehicle? Yes, you can. Cheese and crackers, you can have wheels on a space vehicle. Absolutely. Because once you come out of atmosphere and you come down, you got to get away. Oh, son, you got big old engines on the ground. Now you're getting away. <laughs> anyway, y'all, that's my entry to the Four Horsemen's Outer Space theme build. Hope you enjoyed it. Leave a comment below. And as always, thanks for stopping by the garage. It really does make my day, and it really does make my night. And as always, be safe, be well, and be kind. Always be kind. Till the next time at the garage, I'll see you later, Grease Monkeys.